1988, after four years of postering the streets of Soho, the word on the street that got back to us was that the Gorilla Girls are a bunch of whiners. All they do is complain, 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 complain. So negative. So we took this criticism to heart and we decided to do a poster that would make women artists look on the bright side of their situation. And here's what we did. The advantages of being a woman artist. Not long after this poster was up on the street, we got a letter from a prominent woman sculptor who saw it and said she didn't know whether to laugh or cry. And in the letter, she included a thousand dollar check so that we could run it as an ad in Art News Magazine. It's become one of our best known, most requested, most reproduced posters of all times. It's been translated into many different languages and hardly a week goes by that we don't get a letter from women in fields as diverse as veterinary science, meteorology, mortuary science, telling us that this poster isn't just about the art world, it's about their lives too. Not long after this poster was up on the street, we got a letter from a prominent woman sculptor who saw it and said she didn't know whether to laugh or cry. And in the letter she included a thousand dollar check so that we could run it as an act to heart. And we decided to do a poster that would make women artists look on the bright side of their situation. And here's what we did. The advantages of being a woman artist. In 1988, after four years of postering the streets of Soho, the word on the street that got back to us was that the Gorilla Girls are a bunch of whiners. All they do is complain, 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 complain. So negative. So we took this criticism ad in Art News Magazine. It's become one of our best known, most requested, most reproduced posters of all times. It's been translated into many different languages 